Welcome, Mia Isaac, to the Valdry Beebe Show live out of Dallas, Texas. How are you? I'm good. I'm glad to be here. How are you? I am so excited to talk with you and my audience. You know, I'm talking to the, the, the star of Black Cake, Mia Isaac. She's here to give us an insider's view of something that's very interesting. You know, you guys told me you watched Black Cake or you're watching it. You know, she's a young actress, and she's taking on race and age, and those are topics that are explosive in our societies today. Mia, welcome to the Founder BB Show. Thanks. You tell, you're you doing black, uh, black Cake. You're calling me from London today, so I'm thinking you have been on a whirlwind tour. How has it been to be the star of this Iconic, and I think iconic, this this is going to last a long time, iconic presentation. Oh, I'm so grateful. I mean, from the moment I got the audition, I knew I really, really wanted it, and I would have been devastated if I didn't get the role. Um, but I, I, I just can't believe that it's real, and I can't believe that I get to play a character that I feel like is so true to myself and to my family, and I can't believe that it's being so well-received. I, I just, I can't, I can't say enough how grateful I am. You're so young, uh, uh, from what I understand. You're very young, and, but you are morphing into all of these people. Tell me how it is to, to be young but play I'm a little bit older, I'm a little bit younger. Um, I think it's just part of the job, honestly. I, I've been an actor since I was 10, and um, being an actor definitely – I think ages you a little bit. Um, you become a little bit more mature just because you have to face so much rejection and you have to be really resilient. And um, I think that being on set, you are around a lot of adults as a kid and you learn how to speak to adults and you learn how to kind of mature a little bit rather than you know being in school with other kids. And um, I kind of think that's that's how I've gotten to be how I am today, kind of. With Black Cake, um, you say they chose you. I think you chose this role. But what makes you so perfect for this role? Because you are. Um, I mean, when I read the character breakdown, I was just shocked because I, have, I had never seen an audition for a character that was exactly who I am ethnically. Um, Covey is Chinese and Caribbean, and that's who I am. And I, I showed it to my parents. And um, when we read Black Cake, um, my mom was able to relate to the Chinese culture, and my dad was able to relate to the Caribbean culture. And I had never experienced that before. And it was such a beautiful experience to share that with my parents and to share that with my family. Um, and now with the show coming out, you know, being able to watch Watch it with my Caribbean grandmother and for her to be like, I mean, she makes black cake every year. And so um, it's just surreal. It really is. It is. It seems like it's your life. We had to just wait for you to be born, grow up and step into this role almost, I think. Tell us about what we're going to experience in the synopsis format of black cake, because a lot of people have not watched. Um, yeah, so Black Cake is a story that, you know, spans many, many decades and goes back and forth from present day to the past. It starts with um, a woman named Eleanor who, when she passes, leaves behind um, some voice recordings for her siblings about the secrets that she's had over the course of her life. Um, and we kind of flash back to a younger version of her, um, who I play, um, who is a young girl living in Jamaica in the 1960s. Who was basically sold into an arranged marriage and then forced to leave her country and forced to leave her home. And we kind of just follow her journey from this young girl into this adult woman as we try to figure out how she became this person. We know this is an international movement, but in America, we don't know that much about arranged marriages because we have the power to say yes or the power to say no. What will the American audience understand about this? I think, you know, whether you're American or wherever you're from, you can relate to the core themes of this show. I mean, the show is about love and the show is about family and any human can relate to that. Um, you know, um, there are different cultures shown and I think that's really important for people to be aware of other cultures, but at its core, it's just about, you know, the human experience, which is universal. I know Black Cake is, is your, if I'm correct, your first lead role. What do you think this will do for your career? 
hopefully good things. Hopefully good <laughs> things. I mean, um, this is my first TV show and uh, I, I, I learned a lot as an actor and I definitely think I've grown a lot as an actor and I feel so much more prepared for whatever my next role may be. So fingers crossed. <laughs> Fingers crossed. And young people watching you in this role, what do you want them to know? Um, I mean, I think that, it, I mean, it's got some very sensitive content, so I don't know how many young people will be watching it. But I do think that it's important to see representation. And uh, for me, I, I didn't grow up seeing many people who looked like me on TV. And so hopefully um, I can be that for other young girls. Well, you've been that for us this morning. We feel so honored, Mia Isaac, that you took the time to talk to my audience at the Bounder BB Show. We're looking and expecting good things from you as you continue to grace the big screen and the small screen. When do you want us to watch Black Cake? Can we watch it now? Yes, you can watch the first seven episodes of Black Cake streaming on Hulu now, and the eighth and final episode of the season will be out this Wednesday. Well, we'll be there to support you because you're our new star. I'm really appreciative that you stopped by the Valder BB Show, and we wish you the best that life has to offer, Mia Isaac. Oh, thank you so much. Thanks for having me. Hosted the Valder BB Show. We have over 1,000 videos on ValderBBShow.com and YouTube.com slash ValderBBShow. We upload new videos daily. Our site is a modern baby boomer platform with news and information important to boomers. Subscribe to youtube.com slash show and stay connected as I interview the world's most fascinating people.